Hello guys, welcome. So this one is for the Virgo. Energy reading for the week of April 1 to 7. So let's see the energy surrounding Virgo for the date of April 1 to 7. This is a collective energy reading guys. So um, it may not resonate to all of you, so take what resonates and leave what's not. Energy surrounding Virgos. Okay, the Magician and the Mirror. You have the ability to manifest whatever you want, Virgo. You just have to think of the strategy and how you're going to manifest them. Cornucopia, this is a very fortune, um, fortunate card. It talks about abundance and all that. So Virgo, I feel like right now you're really wanting something at the moment we're in. You're trying to manifest. Okay, manifest that something that you really wanted. And that while manifesting, you're thinking of the strategy on how it will going to make it happen. And then at the end, you know, you are going to get what you want, what you get, ma what you manifested. That's the best card I have read so far. And these are for Virgos. The clarification for magician. Okay, I feel like you're manifesting someone or a situation what that involves um, home because um with the Ten of Cups in reverse, this one talks about being um, dissatisfied with what's going on with your life. It's like you're not seeing those miracles, little miracles that we have um, in our life. So I feel like there are some things that you really wanted and then you feel like, why isn't, why is it not happening? So you ended up feeling um empty and with this five of swords upright it's just saying that um there's some kind of um some things you know that you have to just let go and just go forward so that's why you're manifesting i feel like you're manifesting for a particular person or a situation wherein you can be with your person or you could be with your family so this one involves some cancer scorpion pisces energy as well as gemini libra and aquarius okay for the strategy let's clarify strategy You got the temperance upright, the ten of pentacles upright, okay, the hair of font in reverse. So I feel like with this strategy, you're very, you're um, trying to be very balanced, you're trying to focus in here, so you're really thinking what to do next, so you're really thinking what's the best thing to do um, I feel like it has something to do with your finances. Um, there's some kind of uh, financial success in here. So, as well as some ca some um, form of commitment and happiness. Okay? With the uh, Hero Font in 
reverse it's just saying that um try okay that's why you're you're doing this strategy so you won't be able to make any poor decision okay um because this one whatever situation you are in right now you wanted to make a decision for yourself you're like saying i don't need anybody else to make a decision for myself i really have to focus and think so i'll be able to achieve this ten of pentacles here so a lot of earth signs in here in here as well so capricorn taurus virgo and the temperance it's um sagittarius energy so some of you may be dealing with those signs okay let's go with cornucopia you're having a lot of um you're having a lot of options and you cannot decide during this um strategy okay we got here the seven of cups in reverse the five of cups um in reverse and the devil i feel like this one is just a reminder for you um virgo that whatever you are manifesting okay and sometimes there's a saying that um a delayed thing is not really a bad thing sometimes it's a blessing in disguise so try not to avoid uh try not to avoid so try to avoid looking at those delays you know just be open to see what is um, being offered at the moment and at the same time this is what they're saying whatever you are manifesting just continue manifesting believing that at, that it is yours and at the same time it's better to detach from the outcome so you won't be having any stress you know while thinking or while waiting for the thing that you are manifesting just trust the process and let it flow Okay, I'm going to give you some life coaching oracles. Messages for Virgos. This card is quite big. It's very hard to shuffle. Okay, for Virgos, so it's just say it's time to get things done. Creative project, it's time to get things done. Make your creative projects a priority now. So whatever you are manifesting, your card is just saying start now. So perception, you are getting ready to have a shift and perception that will change everything. So it's all about the strategy. And some kind of reconciliation this relationship um friendship or partnership can be saved so remember capricorn the one that you are manifesting right here it's a happy family um card and this one talks about reconciliation so just continue manifesting if you're manifesting for um, a loved one to come back or your family to be together just continue manifesting for it because um, the card is saying this whatever situation you are with with this um, energy it can be safe so I guess that's all there go so I hope um, this reading resonates to most of you. So thank you and I'll see you for the next week's energy reading. Bye-bye.